Okay, good morning once again. Um, Dr. Prafula Dagle, the principal of Brilliant Academy English Medium School, Fulton. Uh, tomorrow you have your examinations. Now we have just covered almost uh, three parts of our video and we have discussed about the writing skills. In the writing skills, again, the most important topic is about the views and the counter views. The views and counter views are something where it is all about your logical thinking, your creativity. It could be about your own argument about a particular topic, your own opinions, your own views, your own analysis as to how do you visualize a particular thing, how do you analyze it? Because you also need to visualize a particular thing before you analyze it. Okay, it may not be in front of you, but you have the point. So let's focus more upon this particular thing. Let's first talk about the views. See, when you have a particular view which has been asked to you that you have to write your views, it's pretty much clear for you that you it has to be argumentative. You you may come up with your positive views, you may come up with negativity. But remember, when it's it's been asked about writing your views, then those particular aspects comes. Of course, the important sequence and all has been given to you that you should have a proper beginning with a good conclusion. Ensure that your views and analysis are really supportive and in context to what has been asked. Most important that don't give just vague answers. There is no relevancy amongst what you are talking about. Let's say that you have, you have been given an example. This is just an example. Your views on uh, the use of mobiles in school. Now, just don't talk about technology. Okay, we have not asked you in detail about the invention of technology and the advent of technology and how globalization has impacted on it. This is something very vague. Just focus on what has been asked to you. Is that clear? Hope that's much clear to you. Okay, elaborative. Be elaborative but precise. Most important thing. Okay, your language, your uh, logical order of thinking and, you know, is all going to be reflected in this particular thing when you're writing your views and counter views. So is that clear to all of you? Hope that's that's pretty much clear. Now we're just going to talk about the counter views. This focus that you've been given certain points and you're told or you are being informed in your question paper. This is an example to write based on the views given, write your counter views. Now it's, it's very clear that you have to write your counter views and you have been given a particular topic. Let us take a topic that you are, you know, based on the, uh, based on, uh, you know, the particular topic, you have been told to write the counter views. So it's, it's all about deforestation, you know, which is essential for the progress of mankind. It's very clear. Now you are, you are just supposed to write first and foremost thing is about the title, write about the title very clear it's about deforestation you may just write about afforestation the need of the R just you have to reverse the topic you have to give your counter views do you think deforestation is a, is is really important of course not but you have been given the points it could be rising populations it could be flora and fauna biodiversity it could be about the endangered species it could be about global warming there could be so many things children now you have to analyze and take the points out of which has been already given do you think that deforestation is really the need of the hour and uh, you know uh, for rising population and all we need to just cut down the trees and uh, have building constructions of course not so what you are going to do the first thing is to write the title the title would be in your form you may write deforestation question mark certainly not exclamation or exclamatory mark or you may write afforestation the need of the hour and you may go ahead with your views is that clear? So this is something which is extremely, extremely important for you. Very simple, very scoring, but you just need to read it and understand. So these steps are certainly, certainly going to be, be beneficial to you for your examinations. And that's the only reason that I'm making the videos for you so that you understand. It's not possible for you to, uh, you know, meet me and interact with me. So therefore, this particular video is made so that you are pretty much clear before your examination. Thank you so much. Hope you understand this. And uh, we have now covered in the previous video the formal and informal, the verbal and nonverbal, and now the views and counter views. The last part of it uh, remains is about the report writing, uh, most important, and then narrating a story and developing a story, which we'll cover in the next part. Thank you so much.